Hello folks, this is 2019, October, November, paper 13, and the question number is 11. And this is concerned with the chapter forces, and it deals with torque or moment. It says that the diagram shows two pairs X and Y of parallel forces. So X is one pair, Y is one pair. So in a pair X, we have got uh, 20 newton force to the right and 40 newton to the left. They are separated by a distance of 50 centimeter, which is equal to 0 0.50 meters. And in uh, uh, pair Y, we have got uh, 4 newton to the left and uh, 20 newton to the right. And uh, and uh, the distance is again 50 centimeter, which is equal to 0 0.50 uh, meters. So now we have to identify which statement among these things is correct. So the first thing says that X is equivalent to a clockwise torque of uh, 10 newton meter and a force of 10 newton to the left. So let's see. Uh, we have... Uh, 40 newton force to the left and uh, 20 newton to the right so that's why the force resultant is 20 newton 20 newton and uh, it should be to the left because the left one is more so that's why in that sense this seems to be correct and uh, this 20 newton this uh, 20 newton uh, newton uh, in the this side and we have got uh, the distance of uh, this thing uh, 50 centimeter which is about uh, 0 0.50 meters 0.50 meters so if i multiply this by this it gives us a 10 newton meter 10 newton meter and this thing will move the body somewhat like this somewhat like this like this so that it is clockwise so that means uh, uh, this equivalent to a clockwise torque of 10 newton meter is also correct so this correct this correct so answer should be a so let's go for other choices as well because in a level uh, we are often don't have uh, the correct answer we only have the best answer so let's see others. Number B, X is equivalent to a clockwise torque of 20 newton meter only. So this is not uh, correct. It's because it's also equivalent to some sort of force. Force because uh, when the forces are imbalanced, they give some resultant force. It doesn't address that thing. So this is wrong. Also, we have got uh, choice number D is also wrong because it says that uh, this is something equivalent to anti-clockwise torque of uh, 30 newton meter only. So it is incorrect. In C, we have got. Uh, y is equivalent to uh, uh, like this. So here, uh, this is 40, this is 20. So that means uh, this 40 is more than 20. So the resultant force is 20 newton to the left. left. And this gives us torque somewhat like this. This is uh, uh, 50, this is 20. So 20 into 50, 0 0.5, we call it 10. So it is 30 here. It is incorrect. So the only correct choice is choice number A. So choice number A is the correct choice.